This is the real Tom Rose. And Robin. <laughs> and we're here to, uh, to show you how to solve this problem. And this is an interesting problem. They are asking you to find the x-intercept of the line given by um, f of x plus 3, not f of x. So let's start out by plugging in x plus 3. Um, and we'll first figure out that new function. Then we'll look for the x-intercept. So the way functions work is they have an input and an output. Input is defined as the thing inside the parentheses, and the output is whatever is on the other side. So f of x plus 3, when they ask for that, what they're saying is everywhere that you see an x in this function, stuff an x plus 3 into it. So we'll have 7 times x plus 3 minus 4. And they're saying that is a line. What is the x-intercept of that line. Um, they also tell you this equals y. So they're, they want, they're thinking of an x-y coordinate plane line. When they say x-intercept, they want the point where y is equal to 0. Right? Usually they're asking for y-intercept. This time they ask for x-intercept, which is kind of interesting. So x-intercept will be found when the y-coordinate is 0. So let's set 0 equal to um, 7x plus 21 minus 4. I just simplified this which equals 7x uh, plus, let's see, 21 minus 4 is 17. And the answer will be, let's get negative 17 equals 7x and divide both sides by 7. And we'll have x equals negative 17 over 7, or the second answer choice.